Eric is a tank, but... Let's see... Let's target that. That wasn't as successful as I would have liked it to be. Oh well. Let's see. As long as we can start thinning their numbers, really good. Hmm, I'm debating who to heal. Guess I might as well heal him. He'll get the most out of it, I guess. Those guys don't even have the sense to shoot the helpless guys. Kind of annoying. Well, I mean, they're the one-hit kills, so that's the quickest way of reducing their numbers, and they will wake up eventually, so... Might as well kill them while you can. Oh, I think they're running. Thank goodness. That is awesome. Yes, they are running. Victory! Hope none of our NPCs died. I didn't notice whether they died or... Oh, these guys are helpless. There we go, now we're done. Ah, 160 XP. Is this guy alive? Yeah, he's just unconscious, that's cool. Uh, do we still have a... Dang, we don't have any method of detecting or anything that's magical, huh? Well, since there's a bazillion of every one of those things, I don't think that they're magical. Yeah, I don't think any of that's magical. Take the first thing. We'll just take a sampling. But I don't think that's magical stuff. Take the gold. I'm not taking any of the air, so that, that's too heavy. Yeah, we're going to grow pretty snooty about loot. So... Oh, hold on. On a hobgoblin body, you find a note that you copy into your journal as entry 57. So, if you don't mind a little bit of funky stuff with the screen, I'm going to call that up. Um, sorry, this is weird. But, um, I'm having issues, you know, with, like, pausing it or whatever. 57, right? Let's see here. 57. A ratty piece of parchment with large writing on one side. Our spies in the city inform us that the party of, inv of invaders would travel to so-called keep to free it. Yeah, the stutter was in the note and everything. To combat these invaders, assemble a force of no less than three squads. Three squads, oh crap. Travel by boat from the small docks at the west of town to Thorn Island. Move undetected to so-called keep. Find the adventurers in or around so-called keep. Kill them before they can return to the city council with information about... Oh, 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 hold on. Uh, you can't see this. Uh, the true situation at the keep. Return with the invaders' heads as proof of completion of your mission. Upon completion, you will be rewarded with food, treasure, and 
Many snakes. Sign. The boss. Alright, so that's very useful. Now we know that the guy we're after is the boss. So, uh, let me just magic cast Cure Light Wounds on the warrior. Just to have him alive. I don't think I'm going to need... Um, I don't think I'm going to need to fight again. Let's see. Let me get everything that I need back up again. Yeah, there we go. So, yes, yes, yes. We saved. Um, and, you know, sorry for all that weirdness, but it's not working otherwise. This was once the chapel of the keep. Inside the doorway are the dried husks of two orcs, their faces twisted with terror. A large altar dominates the southern wall. Well, let's go in. Gotta go around that. Apparently you can't walk over a pew even though it's like two-dimensional. A pale form rises before you. Parlay. Oh, let's be nice. Lux. That, that was uh, one of the words on that little scroll that we picked up from the skeleton, which I imagine he was like the guard left over, so he had all the keys. We're sort of like harking back to the old days. It's like an old memory. So he's like, oh, I was lost, but that word brought me back to myself, you know? So that's cool. So the shape speaks. I am the life form of Ferran Martinez, bound to the undead spirits of all who die within these walls to guard the keep. Tell me, has the city been freed? Tell the truth. Ferran speaks. The city fell long ago to the unblessed creatures imbued with the might of a magical pool. Chief among these were Tyran Thraxus, Edranka, and Torath. A magical pool. Well, we are playing Pool of Radiance, so we find that quite interesting. With their powers, they ruled and united all else, driving forward to destroy us all. The sage Mendo worked hard to gather record of all these things, but they are lost now, his library overrun. See, so that would be, that might be useful things about Tyranthraxis and, and all this stuff in the library where we get these records that they asked us to get uh, for the commission. To find help for your battles, you should pass through the illusionary wall in the armory of this keep. To pass my guards on the way out, speak the word Samo son. Now we are free, our duty done. Iran fades away. Oh, that's cool. I don't think we should. Uh, oh. We went into the confessory. Uh, let's see, save, see if, make sure I got this right. I guess I must have done that in the wrong order. Uh, you find some gems in a few pages of a diary. You copy these pages in your journal as entry three. All right, once again, hold on. Uh, entry three, coming up. Oh, that was a long one. Uh, I can't bring it up, so. An old leather-bound book written with a small, firm hand. The hordes came again last night. Their coordination was frightening. Under the cover of darkness, goblins and kobolds pushed bundles of sticks to within bow range. These bundles formed a wall that protected the small ones from our archers. Once the wall was erected, orch archers, archers took up safe positions there and began pelting the castle walls with arrows. We tried shooting flaming arrows at the wall of sticks to set it afire. Monsters are normally afraid of fire. But these monsters showed no fear. They simply scooped turd on the flames to put them out. Before all the fires were out, they had resumed firing at us. Surely some unnatural force must have been at work to weld these quarrelsome beasts into an organized fighting force. Uh, 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 an unnatural force like Tyrant Praxis? Uh, what you say? I do not know if we can combat the, mons the onslaught much longer. We lost 12 more men last night. The monsters seem to have an unlimited number of reinforcements. The last priest of Tyr, Ferran Martinez, ah, the guy we just talked to, the last priest of Tyr, says he has a way to protect the keep, but he says that it's so terrible that it may be used only as a last resort. Aha, uh -huh. unless we receive reinforcements shortly, 
friend Martinez is our only hope. Wow, that's dark. That's dark. So basically, he like made them undead to do that. So we got gems. That's always nice. A little story. Now let's take the gems. Alright. Uh, let's see here. What was that? I don't know what that said. Sorry. Um, so. Take wall. There it is. Passing through an illusionary wall, you enter a portion of the keep that remains untouched by time or ravaging armies. There is a glow in the northwestern corner of the room. 